After 62 years, a longtime family owned business in La Crosse closed its doors today. News 8 Now's Emily Haugen is live outside the King Street Kitchen, where the owner says it's time. Hi, Mike and Amy. It's been a bittersweet day for the Zumach family. King Street Kitchen, formerly a country kitchen, has been in the La Crosse area and in their family for the last 62 years. But today, they're saying goodbye. I'm excited for what's going to come about, but I'm sad because I love what I do. For Darren Zumach, the restaurant business is a family affair. It's just what we grew up in, and my three boys work here, and, you know, and um, I work with my sister every day, Dawn, and my dad, so it's been my whole life. People that have watched me since I was 10 years old, I sat at their table and ate breakfast with them. After 62 years in business, it feels like family for its customers, too. It, it's been a landmark in this part of town, so there's a lot of folks like me that are going to miss it. Presented with an opportunity to sell, the Zumox are closing a community staple. I can't say it enough. All the customers that we've had over the years have just been meant so much to me and everybody else here, I know that. Just a lot of special, special people. A kitchen that built families. There's 58 or 59 people that have met and married that worked in this place through the years since my dad's been here. And it's a community of people who Zumok believes in. We've had just so many good employees. It, it's hard. It was hard to tell them, you know, and it was hard to tell my dad, my sister. But he knows it's time to go. It's the right time. It is. We've, you know, times are changing and it's just time. The restaurant closed for the last time at two this afternoon. Darren Zumach says that he's going to spend his time fishing and hunting and enjoying what it's like to actually have a weekend off. He tells us he's very thankful for all the customers over the years and the employees who kept them coming. Mike and Amy? Mm. All right, thanks a lot, Emily. That is a tough business to be in. Oh, uh, it's a 24-hour It's a 24-hour yeah. and then add the pandemic and all that stress mm -hmm. on it as well. So but all those families that are now together because yeah. they met there. That is so cool. Yeah, 59. Congratulations. Yeah. Well, plans are in the works for a CCF bank to be built in the restaurant's location.